Indian scientists had been working, toiling day and night for years and years together. But now, now comes the moment of vindication, the moment of redeeming the pledge to the nation. And coming close on the heels of successful Chandrayaan-3 landing, the successful launch of Aditya L1 is also a testimony to the whole of science and a whole of nation approach with which we have sought to adopt in our work culture. While ISRO is credited in executing this mission, the science institutes across the country have come forward to contribute in one form or the other in small measure or big to this mission. To name a few, the Indian Institute of Astrophysics, Bengaluru, the National Aerospace Laboratories, the Tata Institute of Fundamental Research, Mumbai, the Nijri, NGRI, Nagpur, the IIT, Khadakpur, IIT, Madras, IIT, Delhi, IIT, Mumbai, and the list is too long. But that, having said that, gives me the confidence to say that this day, the 2nd of September 2023, is a day of reckoning when we move on into the next 25 years of Amrit Kal and Mother India pledges with the collective will and collective effort of our 140 crore children to reach and occupy the place of pride on the world pedestal. Congratulations once again, Chairman Somanath, the entire ISRO team, and the entire countrymen. Thank you, sir. Uh, may I request uh, the project director of Aditya L1, Nigar Shaji, to say a few words. It's a dream come true for uh, team Aditya L1, and I'm extremely happy that Aditya L1 is uh, um, injected into the intended orbit flawlessly by PSLV as always. And Aditya L1 solar panels are deployed on the space to be normal. And Aditya L1 has started its 125 days of long journey towards L1. We have uh, our earth burns to rise the orbit and that and followed by the trans L1 injection and finally in session into the halo orbit in the sun earth Lagrange in point L1. Once the Aditya is commissioned, it will be an asset to the heliophysics of the country and even to the global scientific fraternity. And I take this opportunity to thank Chairman Isro, uh, Director URSC, and former Director URSC, and all the Center Directors for their support and guidance for making this mission possible. And my thanks are due to my project team and all the project executives across the center, payload teams, especially the teams from the IAA and IUCA for the relentless effort in building the payload as well as the spacecraft. And my, spe my special thanks to the expert committee who have been guiding all through the entire project life cycle. And I thank all the industrial partners and the entire URSC team for uh, their invaluable contribution and uh, I feel really honored and privileged to be part of this mission and at this juncture I like to remember, I would like to remember Professor U.R. Rao who sowed the seed for this uh, mission and looking forward for a successful HALO orbiting session and for the science, great science output from the Aditya L1 mission. Thank you. Thank you all. Uh. Sri Biju, the mission director and the project director of PSLV. Good afternoon to all. My big salute to all of you for achieving this wonderful mission of Aditya. We have injected Aditya in its intermediate orbit. PSLV in its uh, 59th mission has successfully accomplished uh, injecting Aditya L1 in its intermediate orbit. It's all because of the dedicated effort of all of you. Uh, the challenging requirements given by satellite team was indeed very... Um, um, in, in, in it, it was very challenging to meet the orbital requirements. We have given, gone for a new mission design strategy. We have gone through numerous simulations to validate this and that is the proof that you are having now. 